Marna DeQuant is a business consultant in the Mid-Island area. She works just like the rest of us, but a year ago she added something to her daily routine outside of the office. Great day for a walk. <laughs> yes, it is a good day for a walk. The training actually started last July, starting with a small distance and building yourself up. Um, I'm not an athletic person, so that was the biggest challenge to see if you could actually walk that distance. So I started with 10 and then 20 and 30 and a bit of pain and blisters and experience along the way. I worked myself up to finally uh, 50 kilometers and recently just completed doing 100K over 36 hours. And so it's just building up endurance and your physical strength as well as emotionally is a, a very big part of um, the walking as well, so it's combined. When she was born, she was always um, very much, I can do it. That were almost her first words, I can do it. And as long as I've known Marna, when she sets her mind to something, she generally achieves it. She is strong-willed and uh, she's always been that way. We're not really surprised that she's doing something like this at all. She's uh, very uh, or uh, goal-oriented. There is a reason Marna is putting in 20-hour days working and training. She was selected to be a participant in Holland's annual Walk of the World, an event that has been around for 96 years and has 45,000 participants. I was extremely pleased <laughs> after having put in so many hundreds of hours of training and to have this opportunity also to um, fundraise and represent um, the cause which is really close to my heart. And that cause is supporting stem cell donor research. I'm doing it in memory of my oldest sister Patricia who um, had leukemia and passed away at the age of five. My goal is just to be able to touch as many lives and be able to give the gift of life to as many people uh, around the world as possible. Marna is very focused, is very driven, and she's proven herself to be amazingly uh, proactive with her uh, walk of the world that she's undertaking. Your backpack has a Canadian flag on it, yep. so uh, be sure you take that along. The way we support Marna is mostly with talks and um, my husband with walks. <laughs> yeah, and uh, it, is, it, is, uh, it, it is a very emotional to see her going through the training. It is not easy. We're supporting Marna any way we can. We're going to support her charity, of course, with a donation. And uh, we support her with if she wants to take time off to pursue this. The support that I've received from friends and family and local businesses and my employers has overwhelmed me. Keep doing what you've been doing, Marna. Uh, you've trained for this for a long time. You've proven that you've, you're capable and you're going to uh, do the very best for your charity and we're behind you all the way here. I will miss her, but uh, you know, for the period that she is going to Holland, but uh, I, I think it is a great thing that she's doing that and I'm very proud of her. It has been um, something that I'll never forget and it has been a cause that has changed my life. And I don't know what will happen after the walk, but um, I'm very proud to be able to speak to people about the need and um, I hope that many, many families will not have to go through what my family has gone through. With each step, Marna is making a difference in the lives of patients waiting for a donor match. You can walk with her on this journey through the internet and on Facebook and support her efforts. In Nanaimo for The Daily, I'm Melissa Hall.